Audible, play Game of Thrones. Searching for St. Louis, Missouri. I'll try that again. <laughs> Audible, play Game of Thrones. Playing Game of Thrones. Next chapter. Heard you say next chapter. Somewhere beyond the sunset, across the narrow sea, lay a land of... Pause. Heard you say pause. So, as you can see, not only was I able to launch the application using speech, after a little glitch there, but I also was able to give it a command and control its behavior when I started it. Then, from within the application, you may not be able to see, but I was using UI in the application, I was able to give it a set of commands to control its behavior, like next chapter, and pause. But we didn't stop there either. We want to do something a bit more complex. Search. Heard you say search. What would you like to search for? Apollo. I found one result in your library. Failure is not an option. Mission control from Mercury to Apollo 13 and beyond. Would you like to listen to it? Yes. <clears throat> Given my aircraft test flight background, the con Pause. Heard you say pause. So, it may not have been as, as easy to see there, but I basically had a conversation with my app. I started it by asking it to search, and we continued with a two-way interactive conversation. This was not just with the phone, but this was with my application. And then I can continue to have that com two-way conversation, and I got to exactly what I wanted to without having to touch the screen. We are excited to see what developers have come up with, because this is available to every developer. We have the ability to have speech-enabled applications that can have conversations with each end user, and they can go and use their creativity to take this technology to the next level. As it's probably already showing on my screen here, we are excited to announce that Audible is going to be available for Windows Phone 7.5, that you can go to our marketplace and download it later today. Mm -hmm.